Due to diesel engines being considered environmentally unfriendly and often a focal point in air pollution debates, in 2006, an artist and automotive enthusiast from California, USA, named Michael Sturtz, along with a few of his team members, took an innovative step by developing and campaigning for biodiesel technology in their custom-built motorcycle. This revolutionary project known as Daimoto combined art and technology as Sturtz and his team transformed a conventional motorcycle into a machine powered by biodiesel. Biodiesel, derived from natural sources such as vegetable oils and animal fats, has a lower carbon footprint compared to traditional fossil fuels. Through Daimoto, Sturtz demonstrated that motorcycles could not only be efficient and powerful, but also environmentally friendly. Want to know more details about how the biodiesel motorcycle was made and developed to achieve a world record as the fastest two-wheeled vehicle using biodiesel? Don't skip this video, because there will be interesting things to discuss. Michael Sturtz is a consultant, innovator, designer, and founder of a nonprofit industrial arts school called The Crucible in Oakland, California, USA. This school combines the community of art and industry enthusiasts. Established in 1999, the school has consistently attracted around 5,000 students each year. Various fields taught at the school include stone carving, blacksmithing, metalworking, metal casting, woodworking, jewelry making, and many other creative industries. Due to his dedication to the field of art and industry, in May 2006, Sturtz and his team from The Crucible came up with the idea to create an alternative energy innovation by making a biodiesel motorcycle named Daimoto. As a first step, they chose a 2-liter engine from the BMW 3 Series. For the base frame, they used the BMW R1150RT, deemed suitable for carrying this car engine. The crew from The Crucible, who helped Sturtz name themselves the Diesel Dozen, reflecting the core group of 20 artists, builders, and engineers. They worked together to develop and campaign for the use of biodiesel in motorcycles, aiming to create technology that is more environmentally friendly and reduces air pollution. The engine used in the Daimoto project is an engineering masterpiece, combining advanced materials and technology. The motorcycle's frame was made from custom steel fabrication, providing strong and durable structure. The fairing was formed from custom aluminum, which is not only light but also resistant to corrosion and provides a sleek aesthetic. The transfer case was custom designed and machined with a silent chain drive, ensuring smooth and efficient operation. With a rolling weight of around 1,100 pounds or 499 kilograms, Dai Moto balanced strength and stability. Let's get that fixed and go really fast. Yeah. After waiting a few days, in May 2006, the engine arrived at the Crucible's workshop from England. The main engine used was a 2004 BMW 320DS4 automotive motor, a four-cylinder engine with four valves, intercooled turbo, and a capacity of 1,995 cubic centimeters. This engine could produce a maximum torque of 251 foot-pounds at 2,000 revolutions per minute, and a maximum power of 163 horsepower at 4,000 revolutions per minute. It was designed to run on diesel or B99 biodiesel, making it more environmentally friendly compared to conventional diesel engines. The Diesel Dozen team then adjusted the frame to fit the engine. They cut, welded, and designed the adjustments to match the initial ideas and designs for this motorcycle. Once everything was installed, they tested the Dai Moto on the roads to see if it functioned properly or if there were issues to be fixed. Some issues encountered included the rear wheel coming off due to the engine's heavy load. Therefore, Sturtz and his team made repairs and conducted further testing. Since this motorcycle had a high speed, 
it was impractical to test it on public roads, so they decided to test it at El Mirage Lake in California. After several trials there, they conducted further tests at Bonneville Salt Flats in Utah. This location was chosen because most prototype motorcycles tested at Bonneville used high-octane fuel. However, they wanted to prove that with vegetable oil fuel, this biodiesel engine could achieve top speed at that location. After several tests on September 3rd, 2007, the Daimoto broke the record as the fastest two-wheeled vehicle with a top speed of 130 miles per hour using 100% biodiesel. This achievement was featured in the popular magazine Popular Science and became a hot topic among automotive enthusiasts at the time. This opened the doors for engineers to develop high-standard biodiesel-based motorcycles to compete in speed tests at Bonneville Salt Flats. Not satisfied with the top speed achieved, Michael Sturtz expressed his desire to increase the top speed to 160 miles per hour in the next testing. This was understandable because during the previous tests, there were some computer components malfunctioning, causing the RPM to drop by 700 RPM. Therefore, Sturtz was not satisfied and aimed to perfect this motorcycle to achieve the desired top speed. Thus, this is the history of the biodiesel motorcycle that broke the world record as the fastest motorcycle using a biodiesel engine. May it inspire and provide knowledge to us all. Don't forget to comment below, like, and subscribe. And turn on the bell to not miss the next interesting videos. Hi, <laughs> the turbo. Hi, I was that.